Welcome to BrightSquid Dental Link. In this video, we'll explore the features of the image tools inside the Treatment Viewer. When viewing any stage in a treatment plan, any image-based files will be displayed within the Image Viewer on the right side of the screen. Normal photographic or extra images in common file formats such as JPEG, GIF, or PNG, among others, will be displayed in the Image Viewer we see here. Take note of this toolbar in the upper left corner of the image window. If it's in your way, just click and drag on the top section and move it someplace else. Here is a quick rundown of the tools on the toolbar. The magnifying glass. Select this tool with a single click, then double click anywhere on the displayed image to zoom in for a detailed view. Then you can click and drag the image to reposition it inside of the viewer. To reset the image to its default zoom level, click the reset button here. The second tool temporarily adjusts the brightness and contrast of the displayed image. Single click on this button, then click and drag inside the image viewer to adjust the brightness and the contrast of the image. To reset the image to its default light levels, click this reset button here. This is the privacy box. It allows you to obscure or black out a section of the displayed image. Single click on the box, then click and drag on the image to draw your box. When you are done drawing, release the mouse button. If you are not satisfied with the created box, click on the X button to remove it and try again. If you are satisfied with the box, click the check mark to finalize its position. Note that once the box is finalized, it cannot be removed. This next button allows you to annotate or mark up the active image. Single click on this word bubble button, then click and drag on the image to draw an arrow to the section of the image you wish to annotate. Once the arrow point is in the right location, release the mouse button and the annotation box will appear. Now you can type your note into the annotation box and click the check mark to finalize your arrow and notation. If you choose, you can now fine tune the location of the arrow point and the annotation box. Just click and drag. Note that any notes you type into these boxes will be visible to any colleagues you have shared this case with. If the annotation box is hiding an important portion of the image, use this button to toggle the annotation's visibility. This is the Reset Image button, which we have already discussed. And finally, download the original file. Clicking here will initiate the download of the image file. Note that non-image-based files may also be uploaded to Dental Link. Files such as Word documents, Excel spreadsheets, and PDF documents can all be uploaded and shared via Dental Link. Clicking on any of those types of files will initiate the download of that file. Dental Link also supports advanced file types such as 3D models and DICOM and CT scans. For more information on managing advanced file types, please see our Help and Support Center for those related videos.